This is Monster Party, and this is my good friend Shide. How are you doing, Shide? I'm doing pretty good. How are you? I'm not too bad. Um, so, this game. Uh, so, this is a game you requested, actually, right? Yeah, it's um, it's like a sort of nostalgic classic game for me. I, I wouldn't call it a good game, but it's definitely um, sort of a cult classic thing, I suppose. Mm -hmm. It's very weird, is what I'd say. It looks it's, like it's one of the few, mm -hmm. one of the few NES games that was released in North America, but not in Japan at all. Really? Yeah. I there was there was this like. Mm -hmm prototype of a game of a version that was going to come out in japan but it's like it, it just never did not really sure of the backstory on it but <laughs> yeah it's it's weird that mark here is leaving a baseball game and uh is like moved to tears by this star that he <laughs> sees i mean he really is though it's just so beautiful yeah i'm not I mean, even look making at that <laughs> it's got little small sparkles on on the side of it yeah <laughs> it's a nice star I like the, also the skull outline for everything. It's very dark for what this <laughs> appears to be. It uh, it's that kind of game. It's mm. uh, it's very horror themed, but in a vaguely silly way. <laughs> it's a great conversation. It's a great conversation too. Like I'm I'm Mark. Like I I'm Bird. What's what's up? <laughs> uh, evil monsters out of control in my world. Come and help me. Uh, <laughs> this is pretty under. Oh. Mm. oh, they're right. Yeah, this this was a. This verse says it, it, this is the source of the sea crab's name. This no, game. No kidding. I feel like that's I mean, what verse says. I don't know if I. Heard, <laughs> I feel like I heard that. It's odd too that you say this is only released in North America because I feel like there's some text problems. Like. Like, there is, like, a period that went on the next line that they didn't bother with, fix or anything. And then yeah. bat, bat or anything's it, okay. Hmm? Uh, Let's see. Mark. Mark, my planet. My planet is dangerous. This is pretty terrible that, like, Bert just pretty much kidnaps Mark and then, like... Like, we're going to a hostile planet. I'm not even sure you can breathe there. And I guess... We're melting into each other. Oh boy! Huh. This is how they, Mark. Yeah, they uh, they, they fuse. Yeah, that's a, a gameplay mechanic. Oh, that's graphic for an NES game. All right, uh, so, so you'll see in a moment. Whoa. There is. That's. If, if you remember the uh, title screen with all the green slime that it looked like in the, originally it was gonna ha it was just supposed to be all blood. But that got uh, censored for the version that actually came out. It's... I was just reading the Wikipedia, and apparently the unreleased Famicom oh. version was leaked online in 2014, which I didn't know. So that's something that I might actually have to look into. These like point. these these look like people to me to quote Silent Hill. What the well, what the fuck? It's the Dark World. Fair. So they're just. Uh... <laughs> And Mark's, well, well. Mark's hair is so shiny. What the? <laughs> Should, does this game have, like, unlimited continues, by the way, or? I... Like, should I be safe scumming at any point, or is it, like... There are passwords for every, like, level. I'd say. Eight levels. Uh, oh. I mean, you can, but I, I don't care. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, I see. So Matt, Mark's a batter, so I can hit things back at enemies. Yeah, that's one of the the core. Well, the, the the base strategy for killing things is either whacking them with a the bat or reflecting projectiles back at them with the bat. Gotcha. Okay. So, what is this purple like chin plant supposed to be exactly? All right, this is basically a parody of a little shop of horrors, but it got like really edited. It's I see. supposed to look more like uh like the little shop of horrors. Aud Audrey, Audrey, right? I think Audrey, Audrey, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It was supposed to look more like that. And there was actually a microphone stand in front of it and the speaker behind it. Uh -huh. Which the speaker if you if you well, okay, you're Bert now. Oh, you're ahead of me anyway. If 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 you go if you were to go in the back of that plant, 
they actually just blacked out the speaker, like put black whatever yeah. coloring is over it, and it's the physical speaker still there, and you can go stand on it, and you're just kind of like standing in midair. So that's odd. <laughs> <laughs> I guess like maybe it was a last minute thing, and whoever had to fix yeah, it didn't they did. know they so, could. Yeah, a bunch of the um, a few of the and the bosses and such are were supposed to be more obvious specific horror movie monster parodies um but they had to change some of the sprites and, and some other stuff to make it you know not copyright infringing infringing bert's crawl is really suggestive looking i just want to put that out there to start with and the second thing i want to put out there to start <laughs> with is that uh wait hold on a second here so okay so so I okay. So beating like I guess that beating odd the Audrey mini boss. Whoa! What the? Sorry, I'm dead. Ah! So this is deceased crab, huh? Good. Got it. So hmm. maybe even though that's supposed to be a spider. <laughs> maybe. It looks more like a spider. Yeah, I would have said spider. It is. It's. Why now? Why can't I use this question mark? Uh. There's like a question mark after the boss, and then it doesn't seem like I can do oh, anything like that. All right. Well, I don't know. You win. It you might... win, monster. I'm sorry. <laughs> it might have been a health up, but you're at max current health. I hmm. I, I forget. Sac Sacco two has a question, which is: Are those human legs sticking out of the ground? I mean, they're which, legs. They are I don't legs. Know if they're right. from a human. They're, but they are legs. That's for sure. Because it looks like right now I'm beating up flaming students. You know. Uh, I mean, it is a. Mo yeah, they they Whoa. do look like the the uh, Japanese student uniform. That that is true. Wow, it's got probably dark. it's pro yeah. Oh, here we go. <laughs> that happens. And it's uh, it's probably a reference to some sort of Japanese horror convention or movie I, I don't know so this is a, a Japanese game that was made for North America um well it was made by Bandai and I'm assuming they developed for Japan like in <laughs> North America but it just never came out in Japan I I, I see don't really know why I don't, I don't know the story behind that or anything hmm. it might be one but you know please don't pick on me that's so weird You know what this reminds me of? Did have you, have you ever heard of Raid Two, as in like the Raid, the movie? Um, yeah, I've heard of it, but I haven't seen it. Wait, have I? Wait, I haven't seen it either. I've just seen might have seen that. like scenes online from it. But there's a character there named Baseball Bat. I can't. I don't know if it's okay. boy or man or what. But... I have seen that. Yeah, I remember now. What the hell? How do yeah, I? Yeah, that was the. Not... What's going on with these darned, uh, what do you call it? Oh, I got a key. Maybe that's what happened. These darned, um, uh, question marks, I guess, is what I'm asking. Whoa, here we go. It's turning to Bert now. Batboy and Hammer Girl, that's it, yeah. Those two characters. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, it's not, yeah, there's, like, scenes on YouTube and such if you want to watch. But there, it's a fairly brutal but awesome martial arts yeah, movie. Yeah, I, 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 I watched it, uh... Either early this year or late last, you know, something like that. I think it was earlier this year, actually. Nice. That's pretty good. It's good. Uh, what is it? Indonesia? Indonesian? I think it is. Yeah. Oh, dear. You know, in Indonesian action kung fu, whatever you want to call it. Hmm. Pretty great fight scene, I'd say. I'm, w I'm a little worried about dying. I'm hearing, like, the little blink, 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 you know. You know how that goes, right? The little, hey, you're going to die, blinking sound. But we we'll only do. have one life left, so hopefully you survive. <sighs> I guess we'll find out together. Do you have anything you want to plug while you're here, by the way? Do you do stuff on the internet? Mm, no, <laughs> not really. Are you a content creator or just a, a parasite? No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> oh, definitely a parasite, yeah. Nice, me too. Definitely. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, I subscribe to a few streams and oh, Patreonize them. Thank you, pal. Yeah. I appreciate not, it. Not a total leech, but, you know. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
but I've never been a, a creative one, so I've uh, early, earlier, back in the LP days, I tried a few of those, but they never <laughs> quite went anywhere. So good, it was a waste really of time. It, so it was a yeah, waste yeah, of time. Total waste of time. Yeah. Oh no, I died. Oh no. Oh. Ooh, okay, continue. Oh, serious? Damn. All right. Um. <laughs> Oh, that's right. All right. It's all right. So we'll have, that's to, right. we'll have to do a little better this time. Um, yeah, okay. You're going to have to save scum. <laughs> I okay, forgot that's... about that. That's very that's... rude. No, that's fine. Yeah, that is rude. Of the game. Of the game, right. Mm -hmm. All right. So here's the deal. I got to fight Audrey the second again. I, uh, all right. You yeah. said if I go behind, you'll see that they black. They, like, blacked out the... Whoa. Yeah. There you know. It's just like... Yep. Yeah, originally there's like this is the speaker sprite and I say that's why you can just stand there I guess people figured that out uh after a while and the monster party like scene kind of came along yeah sure, sure. it was uh I was reading about a, a restoration project going on from like looking into the game code and changing some of the stuff that was supposed to be more like the uh Original, <laughs> or like the the Japanese release that never came out, with the the blood instead of the slime on the first screen, and <laughs> the start continue selector instead of a pumpkin. I think it actually is was supposed to be like a like a shrunken head. Mm -hmm. hmm. That sort of stuff. Interesting. Hmm. Oh. Apparently, mm. according to Kawaii Ninja Cat, the deceased crab is actually a dinosaur. But it's funnier to see it as a crab. I th I think I think really? they're I think they're full of shit. That doesn't seem right. I don't know. Never heard that before. I Me neither. Was later. So this this seems like. Well, I, I have a couple things to say here. First of all, it seems like I'm wondering if this fight is just completely optional, or if I should not even do it. You know. Uh, no, you, you have to, you, there's, um, you, you have to fight and beat all the bosses before the key appears and then you can go to the next level. I see. Uh, I think there's, there's at least one optional boss and at least one boss that you actually have to, have to not beat or else the game's unwinnable. Interesting. The bug, apparently, but. No, it's weird because I feel like last time, uh, this, like, question mark gave me, uh, you know, Burt powers, but this time just nothing happened. People, uh, it's funny because, like, the folks who know Monster Party are, like, into Monster Party. It's like, yo, Monster Party, what's up? <laughs> I feel like I missed out on something in my childhood. Well, well I mean, I, I did. watch Nick Arcade that I did that featured this. <laughs> Um, yeah, I saw that episode. I wanted to go right out to Children's Palace and buy it. <laughs> and uh, I don't know if you had any Children's Palaces where no, you lived as a child. Uh, yeah. I, d I didn't, actually. There's Funko Land kind of by me. But, mm -hmm. uh, you know. I think I remember Funko Land. Babbage's oh. was another big place for games I used to go. Definitely Babbage's. Oh, yeah. That lasted a little while later. Mm -hmm. I think Children's mm -hmm. Palace went on business in like the mid-90s or something. Those were the days. Yeah. Babbage business became GameStop. No kidding. I actually didn't okay. know that. That's. I believe that's what happened, or else GameStop bought them out. I can look that up. So that's a dinosaur? Oh, I yeah. see it now. It actually looks very Ridley-esque, you know? I'm not usually one to point oh, out yeah. that... Um, like, I'm not usually one to point out that, like, like yeah. Ridley-ish things, but that, that one is... I definitely I see a Ridley head there. Yeah. yeah. What about that? <laughs> wow. All right. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear. All right, come on. Come on, student. Wow, that's so funny. I really did see that as a crab. That's incredible. All right, it's not incredible. All right, maybe I overstated that a little, but, you know. <laughs> um, 
I think Rurs brought it up. There's a game called Eversion, like E V E R S I O N, that like had a sort of mechanic to where it, like it was like a platformer, but um Oh. I played that briefly. I yeah. It's a short game. I, I did finish it, but like uh yeah, yeah, you, you okay, were, yeah. uh, you, you had like, it had like a dark world kind of thing to it where like you were suddenly yeah. just sort of transported. Yeah, I played that, but I don't think I got too far in it because, I don't know. You're not good at video games? No, actually, not really. <laughs> well, you're better than I am, I'm sure. Like, a lot of platformers I'm, I'm not very good at. I, I mostly play RPGs, so that's my bread and butter. I hear ya. Some of the some of these bosses I don't quite understand the strategy to, you know? Like this guy, like the pumpkin head guy. I don't it doesn't seem like I have enough room to actually like duck under him or anything. So like the best I can do is try to bat stuff that comes my way before it gets here, obviously, and then I just have to like wail on him when he's there. Yeah. I guess that's the best I can do. Oh hey, I turned it to Bert. So This looks cool, says Dame plays games. <laughs> Oh dear. Yeah, I, th I think that's a pretty good subscription. Kind of cool. Total. Description? Did I say that? Whatever. Description. Some kind of description. I think it is. Let's see here. Oh boy. All right. So uh, I don't. So I don't know what the kind of party the monsters are having, but it seems I'm like a try to kill Mark party. That's fair. <laughs> It seems almost like they they heard the song Monster Mash and wanted to make a song out of it, and that didn't quite work out so well, but, you know. They didn't want to infringe the copyright. Right, 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 yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's Audrey the Audrey the Second, maybe, whatever, but, like... I wonder if the dinosaur, like, the dead dinosaur is supposed to be something. Uh, I don't know. I don't even... I didn't even know it was supposed to be a dinosaur, so... Me neither. Uh, let's see. Empty. A monster party is very different than a human party, says Bechtelon. That is true. Yeah. Hold on a second here. What if we are just ruining their party, though? That would be kind of... Hold on. There's playing victory music now. Oh, oh yeah. I see. You yeah, have to kill... I got it. You have to get the key and go to the end door, and then you'll get to the next level. Here's... All right. I'm going to GD... Is that an O or a zero? I hate this part about NES passwords. Yeah. Well, it's one or the other, I suppose. Yeah, that's fair. Or you could just save state, because... That's... That, I did do that. <laughs> You're very right, and that's what I did. I don't know how many stages are in this game, but hopefully not more than ten. Whoa. Eight. What the... What's happening to my sprite? Like, whenever I jump, it looks like Mark hits his head, and then he's, like, actually, like... Yeah. That's he so is hitting weird. his head on the top. Which really doesn't damage you. <laughs> Look at that! He's a fish with legs! That's so ridiculous! <laughs> That's just crazy. That is, though. What the... And here's just, like, a uh, monster that's constantly puking. Mm -hmm. If you think these that's are bad, one. you should play the uh, SNES Musical Ninja. Um... This one. Yeah, yeah Gomon. <laughs> which is, like, yeah, they... Oh, Reverse Mermaid, of course. There you go, Reverse her Mermaid. The kind Fry liked. Alright, what the? Whoa. Or oh, you. Uh, I love the bus quotes. Why... Why is this... Why is this Medusa shooting, like, rats at me? Uh... Yeah, rats. Let's go with rats. What are, the, what are those? Uh... Slugs? But like you said, rats. Obviously. I can't see. They go so fast. Are they snakes? I mean, they're, they're like... They're just fat snakes. Those are fat snakes. I think those are Sukinoko. That's fair. Uh, <laughs> Sukinoko isn't a thing. No, um... Suchinoko. Those are su Suchinoko. You're right. Sorry. Sorry. Uh. I apologize. <laughs> Yeah, you better be sorry. I am. I am. Some Japanese words wrong. Come on now. <laughs> Gomen Nasai. Um. All right, here we go. No, I. Uh, you know, they were in um Tsuchinoko, I think we're in one of the like Aria of Sorrow. I think is one of the secret enemies to get, and I got used to calling it Tsukinoko, even though. 
Yeah. Even though it's wrong. Terrible. Oh look, it's the alien egg. Here we go. Stupid fish heads. And okay. One of the later bosses was supposed to be an alien. Xenomorph alien. Right, right. But <laughs> Yeah, that definitely didn't fly. No. I mean, hats off to Mark if he can fight off the Xenomorph with the with the baseball bat, but, you know, come on. I really, I feel, you know, I don't really feel bad for Bert. I feel like if this is his, like, plan is to just steal kids to save his planet, then maybe he, uh, maybe his planet really was not worth saving. Yeah, he kind of just, he, he recruited literally the first person he came across to right. save his planet. I'm I'm not sure that's the best plan, honestly. Even if he does have a baseball bat. What if he thought maybe he thought uh like it was just a freelancer's planet, you know? And also the alien egg shoots bubbles at me, which is kind of And takes like a thousand hits. Uh I have played Alien Crush for the record, by the way. And Devil's Crush. Which is our these old Turbo Graphics sixteen like pinball games, but um Alien oh, Crush yeah. like had like a whole body horror oh, like yeah, yeah. kind of thing, or I shouldn't say body; it's like an alien horror kind of like that biomechanical sort of stuff, you know. Yeah, I never uh, Giger, Giger esque, Giger esque. You know, Thank you, by the way. Yeah, you, know, you got it. You're one of the few people oh. who pronounces that correctly. I knew that was going to be empty. I watched enough of your videos and such to know to how know, to pronounce yeah. it. By now. It's fun. I mean, I'm not. I have no business like correcting people because I am not an authority on Giger at all, but like I did I did look that up even though like in the first Dark Seed video I also said he was from Sweden, I think, even though he's actually Swiss. So just don't listen to what I say half the time is the is the takeaway. Yeah, I'd say that's an accurate presented. Hmm. Here we go, here we go, here we go. They're, they're breeding blue Yoshis. Sacco too. So what are you playing these days? <laughs> Uh, right now I'm working through World of Final Fantasy. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh, All right. It's, it's a fried boss. shrimp. <laughs> it really is. Ah, uh, yes, that's boss. Indeed. Now you can obviously tell from the background, uh, mm -hmm. there's a reference to the fly. Oh. I'm, yeah, it's a shrimp though. For now. For now. Literally laughed out loud at the shrimp. <laughs> I do miss the old days when you like hit a boss and then the whole room would lie up, light up, you know? <laughs> yeah, because the right the lower color pellet had the. Thank you, thank you, Evil Crash. Let me just reload everything here. Sorry, just loading up. Ah. Gosh, this boss is not easy for a giant piece of fried shrimp. It's like, it's a tough boss to hit. Like, yeah. dodging it wouldn't be a problem, except, like, my attack is, like, one t tile. Well, I'm saying that and I'm getting hit. Uh-oh. There we go. Oh, what? Oh, no. No, 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 no. You can't be an onion ring later. Or, I guess, calamari, really. There's, right. there's there's a better strategy I got now. Okay. Almost. Yeah, that's a better strategy. Yeah. Well. I wouldn't say this game is particularly difficult if you know what you're doing, but in not. Oh, what's this? That's like, weird. How did that happen? Some of the just boss patterns are particularly complicated. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> yeah. Let's redo that, knowing what I know now. Yeah. Oh, the Unfunion. I like there that. There you go. The Unfunion. Nice. Mm -hmm. From, uh, These monsters know how to party, though. I will say that. Lynx Winters. Good job, Lynx Winters. Oh, my God, says Yuri. <laughs> oh. 
I mean, it's funny because now I'm like, I wonder what bosses. <laughs> now, like, this completely throws a wrench in the work because you're like, well, I know I'm gonna fight monsters, and now it's like, yeah, you're gonna fight all horror monsters, horror. Oh, you geez. know, all your favorite classics like uh, giant uh, plant and uh, <laughs> spinning jack lantern head, of course. Right. It's but funny. Now you get fried shrimp. Somebody is mentioning too. This is like a. This might be like a pun on fr fry fly, you know, which is like an old like kind of. They, could be, could be. <coughs> it's like that's like a kind of common like you know like uh, localist yeah. or translation thing. Yeah. But, oh dear. I can never be too sure what's just supposed to be a joke boss and what's like been changed due to copyright. <laughs> so. Oh jeez, this one's actually kind of hard. I guess because the shape of it, it's like a little tough to tell where you can. Hit. There we are. Yeah, cool. Oh, good points. Thanks. Anyway. Oh, shit. Alright, 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 game. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Here. I did... No. Oh. I did, uh... I recorded, I recorded a complete LP of this way back. Mm-hmm. When, you know, way back when in the good old days of yore. But I never actually posted it anywhere. <laughs> I think I'm gonna show... I think I might have shown my one friend, but that's about it. It uh -huh. wasn't particularly good. No, that's not true. Well, his yeah, plays in general are pretty bad, so who knows? No, I'm kidding. Um, hey, we're halfway on our way to the high score. That's right. Nice. Nice. All right, I gotta just, I gotta. I think this crocodile is throwing its tail at me. Oh wow, one hit. So yeah, the, I guess the reflection thing seems to like really hurt the most. Like, it looks like you get a damage boost from that, you know? Maybe I'm crazy. Yeah. I mean... I think right. so. I, I fought my two bosses, but I still don't have a key, so I guess I have a third boss to come. Oh, yeah, there were three bosses in the first level, counting the uh, deceased dinosaur, or whatever you want to call yeah, it. Yeah, one of them was just already been. It was uh, pre, pre beaten. Mm hmm. Nice for the first one. No, totally. Yeah, hitting hitting monsters back totally hurts more than uh, just beating them with the bat. I gotta remember. I should remember that for for, for my uh, monster party speed run, I guess. But um. Huh. Well, gotta look it up now. What's that? Monster party speed run. Mm-hmm. Or at least the time of the record. There's probably, like, some way you can, like, walk through a wall and then the game's just over and then it's like, okay, there we go. Like, 34 yeah. seconds or some shit. Mm. Does it look like it? 15 minutes, says chill guy. Yeah. Yep, 15, 28. I, I mean, Bert has lasers. I feel like Bert is way better than Mark, you know, in the whole, like, monster-killing field. I think. That's my contention. I also noticed, so far, at least, there hasn't been, like, a dark world, you know? I think mean, time oh, to do... this level? Yeah. Oh, we're fighting, uh... a, we're fighting a wishing well now, I guess. We're shooting plates at me, I'm assuming, which it's, would be coins. Okay, uh, no, it, it is actually plates. I know oh. this is from some kind of Japanese The ring? Uh, I don't know sure. about that. I think it predated the Reference? Ah. It's from a version of the... Wishing... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, go ahead. The Haunting Wishing Well. Oh. Uh, it says here... Uh, a reference to the Boncho Sariyashiki ghost story. Whatever that is. Right, that one. Oh, of course. It's a Japanese ghost story. We'll just call it that and uh, move on with our lives. <laughs> I thought it was from that version of the ring where Sadako slash Samara is a, a dishwasher. And then he like does the... Whoa! Like, thank, oh. thank you, thank you, Baked Turnips, for subscribing with Twitch Prime! Nice. Nice. Don't forget to resubscribe next month! No, I'm just kidding. Um, at the end, there's a... to remind you about that. <laughs> Actually, which doesn't like to remind you about that, yeah, I should say. Exactly, yeah, because it's like 
free money they're giving away. So it's like, yeah, I'll just not right. tell people you that. Actually, go in and, and check and see. Oh, I'm not subscribed anymore. Got to click. And I thank you all very much who do that. Oh, come on. Stupid egg. Okay. I had to check and I am subscribed. I think that was only like last weekend. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Because you are my Twitch Prime subscription. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it so much. I only Yay. Kind of started uh, heavily watching streams later last year. I watched a few beforehand and Arcade Fence since early last year. Please, uh, please it? don't subscribe to beat us next month. I'm begging you. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> J D. I don't know why I'm putting all my passwords in uh, the the Twitch chat so <laughs> I can tell everyone. Um, I guess. But anyway, I'm using save well, states also. But it's totally uh, pointless. It's, oh, it's so if they want to play along, see. Mm -hmm. Right. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Serious. Let me turn off my mouse cursor. Yeah, if you want to, if you want to play along on your own version of uh, whoa. See, you know what's weird? They didn't do the dark world mechanic in that stage, and it also seems well, like mm? it's, the the first stage is really the only level that actually does that, which is oh, it's kind of disappointing. Kind of disappointing, but I guess it's sort of like uh, <laughs> just for the first level, you're 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 starting a new game, and you don't know you don't know it. And you're like, hmm, this game doesn't look that or or yeah horror ish i don't know and you get to that point and everything turns to skeletons and blood you're like oh okay <laughs> but then there's still goofy stuff so it's like an odd combination <laughs> sounds like american a horror combination story. of mild gore and goofiness mm -hmm. and large head skeletons what are they these i wonder what these skeletons like like what they were when they were all alive um, Just like humans with giant heads? Bobbleheads. Mm -hmm. I can't tell Living if that... Heads. I can't tell if that... Oof. I can't tell if that skeleton is... Uh, that enemy is adorable. No way. Bobblehead skeletons are freaking scary. I said it. Move it. <laughs> That's boss. What the... Yeah. <laughs> I assume you see what he threw at you. Yes. Threw, threw yep. He's also he making little, phone. like, cow, like, moo kind of sounds, you know? That's so what? Playing through Sweet Home the first time. I never played Sweet Home, have you? Uh. No, no. Do you that know that? That's, that that's like a. It's a Nintendo game that's supposed to be, like,. Genuinely scary, but but I don't buy it. It looks like an RPG, which is in like I'm like, huh? You know? Oh, it's. I was annoyed because I was I thought Clock Tower, like the SNES version, was the funniest thing because of like Scissor Man, because he, he looks like ridiculous until someone pointed out he's supposed to be like really like like a kid, and then it's like, no, oh, all right. Now he doesn't look so ridiculous. Now that I know that, I assumed it was like. A movie monster dressed up like you know, in like a little Lord Fauntleroy kind of outfit. But no, it'll ruin my humor about everything. Anyway, yeah, console horror games are kind of odd and few and far between. Oh, my legs are asleep. <laughs> what the hell is this? It's a mummy, but they—it's a transparent mummy. <laughs> Why is it a transparent mummy? It's the Invisible Man. Who's also a mummy. Oh, I assumed it was a mummy from the <clears throat> Sphinx. Uh, uh, yeah, Sphinx. That's what we'll call that. Oh, and uh, uh, I can't remember what the name of. There's like these umbrella, you know. It's a Japanese. It's yeah. a Japanese myth thing, and I can't think of the name. I of can it. never remember what those are called. <laughs> but we can look it up. <laughs> Casa Obake. Right, that was my first Wait, guess. I don't think that's actually. Casa Obake says Poxini. Is that? Oh, okay then. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah. I guess if I wanted to like do this somewhat legit, I could grind okay. for health. Uh, 
<laughs> nah, I don't know about that. Let's see here. Probably easier just to save scum. I mean, it's definitely easier just to save scum. Oh, yeah. No. Your save's coming. Absolutely. <laughs> Let's see here. here. Come here, bat. Or, I keep thinking it's a bat, but it's really just a, an umbrella. Yeah. Just like in real life. <laughs> I will say it's ambitious though that it's like it's only stage three and there've been about like seven bosses so far, you know. Yeah. Wonder have you finished for level? Have you finished this game? Uh, with liberal use of save states, yes. <laughs> Although with the um, password system, it's uh, not that hard, mm -hmm. you know. Right. Anyway, you're, you're yeah. really just starting from the start of each level, so it's not like yeah. Yeah. It's just the but I know yeah. yeah. I know as a as a kid I, I did I was not able to beat it. But only after later in life in save states was I able to beat it. I was like that with Battletoads. It's particularly yeah. hard, but No, I hear you though. It's I was like yeah. never too good at games in the first place, so I barely beat any Nintendo games when I was a kid. Well that just meant you like were cool and going to parties and such. I understand. <laughs> no? All right, well. I was trying to help you on that one, but whatever. Oh, dear. I'll suck all your blood. The tall spider. My one issue is I feel like I have no control over, like, where to, I can hit things back, you know? This dude is a yeah, lobbyist it's... for big safe state. Um, no. What are you talking about? Are you? You have to tell uh, me if you are, like a cop. Uh, uh, I mean, I mean uh, <laughs> everybody, save state. <laughs> Thank you for safe stating. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. Thank you. I don't know if I have enough health for this guy. Let's yeah, see. the oh, I was gonna say the pseudo physics on the reflection mechanic is uh, that's yeah, it's odd. <laughs> Yeah. All right, I'm going to see if I can kind of like scum maybe these umbrellas into giving me health. No? Maybe we can do that. No, because actually this, this does not work, gonna work at all for me. Hmm. All right, this is going to be a problem. Are you going to MAGFest, by the way? Nah. Good. I don't usually go to conventions and such. <laughs> Let's see here. Let me try this spider monster again. Wow, this boss sucks. So to speak. Alright, let's see what I can do. Alright, no, 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 hold on. Alright, so let's let's save scum gently. Yeah, I don't really know exactly. Okay, I do have one strategy, actually, I can think of right now. So let's start here. We're going to minimize the number of, like, you know, he's con contact damage by standing to the edge. So he can only hit me, like, once per round, roughly, or he can still use the projectiles to hit me, but whatever. We'll just pretend I... We'll pretend my strategy is sound. There. There we go, that kind of worked actually, and I got the key. But I do need health. Can you duck when the spider jumps? Yes. My only problem with and ducking is it's not great. <laughs> you move very slowly. Mark likes to do a kind of little wiggle worm dance when he's ducking. Oh, there's the end of the stage I'm, though. An odd animation. Maybe we can just reach the end of the stage and be done with it. Bang! You can just run. Yay. There you go. There we go. Here's another password. Fin2B4SP. Okay. Round four start. Hmm. Now we're in an Egyptian kind of stage, I get What? That <laughs> That's garbage. That's garbage. Oh, I remember what your <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, 
just standing on a regular stone. That's yeah, whatever. Simple. Fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine, Monster Party. Whatever, you know. Hey. There's a screenshot of this in the LP archive. Well, all right. That's probably from back in the day. Empty. Sweet, oh, sweet home. Oh, sweet like, home. Gotcha. I was going to say, yeah. I was going to say, yeah, a, a screenshot LP of this wouldn't make I mean, sense. <laughs> to be <laughs> fair. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes, like, back in the day, it's like, oh, yeah, there was... You know, know it was really old, I suppose. Yeah. Like, we didn't... Yeah. Back when everyone was was young and life was all in front of us. Mm -hmm. well, all right, I became a uh, I became a gargoyle again. Um, I'm wondering what. All right. I don't even know if I want to fight this boss because I have so little health. But. Yeah, let's, I'll try the boss, because... Hey, I beat the high score! Okay. I'm a slowpoke. I'm a slowpoke? Uh-huh. Okay. You can get there fast enough. Yeah, obviously. Alright, let's see. Alright, let me try this boss again. I might have to restart this level because I don't know if I have enough HP for this particular part of it, you know. But we'll see what happens. Oh. What the yeah. fuck? Hmm? Oh, it looks like it was a. It's a. Oh. It's... It looks like it was a Tanuki, maybe? I don't know. Whatever. Whatever stage four. Okay, the oh, garbage the stage. Just collapsed and the sort of spirit came out from the top. It's like a, kind of like a fox line, man. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. None of these bosses that seem... None of these bosses seem dodgeable, says the DLL. A sentiment I do not disagree with. Some of them are in that you have to run under them while they're jumping, but some of them aren't, which isn't great. But it's also hard because, like, the jump, some of their, like, jumping doesn't follow a pattern. It seems, like, RNG-based. So it's like, yeah. I just gotta hope they're gonna, I gotta hope they're gonna dodge, baby. Oh, nuts. I have to go back to that door. There we go. Come on, give me uh, NES games that are known for their undodgeable BS. That is true. Mm. At least them. if you don't know the game. That's fair. That's the way we like it. I know a lot of Mega Man bosses seem like they're... The first time you play it seems like they're just total undodgeable BS, but uh, after you get to know them, they aren't. <laughs> All right. Sure. All right, you'll see. Oh. <laughs> I like this boss. He's cute. I like him too, actually. Are you swatting its own kittens back at it? They're nightmare demon kittens, to be honest. I mean, look at them. At least we can assume they're kittens. I'm not entirely sure. The strategy doesn't... My strategy is not working anymore. There we are. I do appreciate that they kind of, like, tried to make the sound effects. Like, like you know what I mean? Like, the one boss did moo at you, and this boss, like... It sounds like they're going for a meow. Yeah. A sort of... Bad NES meow. Ridiculous. Oh, hold on a minute. Here we are. Alright. I believe in my ability to beat this boss. I don't know why I do, but I do. Oh, it's not a particularly hard one. 
you just have to get kind of luckier with your weird there we go. reflection, whatever. Hey! Damn it, I was just like button mashing and it was working and then I got hit and now I... Yeah, there's a little bit of timing involved, but... Sometimes you can button mash away to the victory. Boss takes a lot of hits. What if it's invincible to having its own cat sit back at it? That would be... I would feel really stupid. Awkward. Alright, I think nine more cats should do it. Eight. Seven. Sit. Seven. Six. This is what I do when... Oh, things get kind of bullshit as I start counting things that... Even though I can't know. There we go, what the real count is. Alright. Yeah. I did beat the boss, but I have, like, one health. So... We're gonna have to hope. Cause the, the scorpion thing's gonna be a problem, so I might have to go back and beat that boss with more HP. Seymour was Rick Moranis in the movie, and if you didn't know this about Little Shop of Horrors, by the way, there was an like the original ending oh, yeah. is much darker. Uh, I think I've heard about that. I can't really remember the specifics though. There's the original ending, like they filmed it, and it's like it's on YouTube. Uh, but it's in black and white, and I don't know why. Like, the YouTube one. The darker ending, you know? And, uh, um, yeah, but, see, but Audrey takes over the world, basically, and, uh... Uh, yes, instead of the normal ending where they get their house, and isn't there a little Audrey? I believe. I think so. And then they made an animated series. That's right, I forgot they did. That, yeah, this is going to be a problem. I'm going to have to fight the cat again. Hmm. That's not good. Sorry. Hold on a minute here. All right. So what we have is a leftover daily. Hmm. Yeah, I was, see, I don't know the jargon. What's a daily? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I assume it's some sort of free... Uh, Unfinished uh, production sort of thing. Mm hmm. Alright. I hit this thing ten times, right? I'm wondering what the actual, like, number you have to hit back f from it is. 13, 14. Really? Too many. Yeah, this is a strong, annoying. Oh, damn it! I didn't expect yeah. two in a row. The RNG is annoying, too, because, like, sometimes it. You know what I mean? Like, you're not. It'll do like five in a row and oh. then nothing for a little bit. Hey, all right. A daily is it that day's film material, no editing, no special effect shots. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. If they only had that, the just totally basic footage of it. Yeah. I still don't get why it's black and white. Well, maybe it was, I don't know. Who the hell knows, frankly. What's your favorite alternate ending to a movie? Go. Five seconds. <laughs> Too late. Uh, uh, yeah, that's something I have to think about because I cannot really think of any off the top of my head. Uh, Seven had an, inter like, had an interesting storyboarded alternate ending where Morgan Freeman shoots the guy. Oh, wow. Well, there was the I Am Legend alternate ending. I know that one's better than the real in the that's when we like kind of realizes he's the jerk i think yeah he's basically the the jerk yeah. monster to all the uh you might want to just go off the password because i think it gives you more health than what you had left over from the last save state i'm still do i'm doing okay i'm still uh, alive health is an option oh yeah army of darkness that was a good one. What the fuck is this? Yes, yeah, multiple people are saying that. Yeah, definitely. Army of Darkness. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, cool. I got, uh... Alright, I got the key. So we just gotta survive to the end of the level.
Oh shit. Alright, that's gonna be easier said than done. I know one good mm, strategy for this is to try to get Bert mode into bosses as long as possible. Yeah. It just he's you know, way easier to beat stuff with. Sure, sure. But it's not I think it, like most drops are random and kind of crappy, so ah. all the question marks are random in that they can either be just crap nothing points or elf or a bird pill. There we go. I've still not seen Get Out. Somebody mentioned that in uh, chat. I keep hearing how good that is, but still have not seen I it. I haven't seen that. Is this Goonies or some shit? No, it's Monster Party. I thought I had it in the little, like, Twitch thing, you know? Oh, shit, okay. Uh... Go! End of the stage. Oh, uh, it does not look like the game's name is in the, in the title. I'm distracted by that weird line on the top of Beef's screen. Oh. Oh, yeah, that is there. What is it? It's... A weird line on the top of the screen. Oh, I'm sorry. Is it gone now? No, it's uh, kind of in the top right, slightly to the left of the corner of the screen. Do we really know what it is? I don't see it at all. There's a few pixels. I'm like zooming in on it on my TV here, and I don't. Oh, I s wait. What is that? Uh, oh. Hmm. oh, there. Oh, I'm sorry. There, okay. I apologize for that. I had no idea that was there the whole time. Shit. Alright. How spooky. Alright. Anyway, it's gone now. So let's save state. And move on to round five. This is a much different stage than the previous. So, I don't know. Egypt is pretty different, too. So... I feel like uh, this is, what? Uh oh! Holy shit! 